Hello everybody, welcome back to Best Life and Me on Home is where the vlog is. We're starting off on the deck today because Katie has procured quite a breakfast. Oh, it's just some cheesy eggs and half a piece of toast. <laughs> Your cheesy eggs and half a piece of toast. That's all it is, nothing fancy. Katie's Cafe has uh, quite a view. You're gonna wanna, it does, doesn't it? Yeah, you're gonna wanna patronize this business because uh, look at this. It's a it's location, location, location. Well, it's nice because there's a little sun fight. Yeah. Like, it's been really good. I mean, it's still coming in and out here and there, but. And look, it's low tide. Yeah, we're gonna get down there as soon as possible. Oh, yeah. All right, cheesy eggs. Uh, look at Chris is out there and the dolphins are with him. He's got a good little little pod hanging out with him. Look at that. They've accepted him into the pod. Because they could take off really fast if they wanted to. But that's really cool. They're not uh, they're not tripping on him. It's always cool when you can make that happen. I've had that in the kayak where they just allow you to cruise with them really close. Made it down to the beach. It's, uh, it's splendid. I know, this is finally our return to the beach. Oh man. Finally. There's a nice little breeze, super, super light breeze, and it's... It's so nice. It's dare I, nice. dare I say, perfect. Dare you say perfect. Yes. But we have to be really thankful because we're in this, like, time, April, May, June. Yeah. It's, it can be just so cloudy and overcast during these yeah. months, and, like, you know, it's so nice when we're having just a little bit of sun. And yeah. We're thankful for every minute that we get to spend on, you know, on this beach right here. Every second is a thankful moment. Yep. How are you feeling today? Um, I'm feeling good, I guess. I feel pretty good too. I think, you know, it's funny is I, I turned a corner. Yeah. The last couple days I noticed I turned a corner of like, you know, a little bit more of like happiness and acceptance. Yeah. I think like more than I already did. Like I know I did a little bit, but now I really feel like I'm like Yeah. I know I guess the first like I don't know, fifteen days, sixteen days, I was thinking like, oh my gosh, it's never gonna reopen. Like you don't see the light at the end of the tunnel. And the other thing is, yeah. is um a few people were talking on Twitter, they were like, I know it's a um there's a lot of other things important right now and a lot of stuff going on that shouldn't devalue the fact that like yeah. we really miss Disneyland. Like yeah. why can't we own it and be like, you know what, I miss Disneyland. I wanna go back there. Like <laughs> what's why yeah, there's other things, but that doesn't discount that I care about other stuff. But right. like you're allowed to yeah. miss things. Everybody misses whatever their joy is. Yeah. Uh, it's so it's, much more to us than yeah. like, you know, I, I don't know. And so I just miss it and like yeah. I just want to say it all the time. I'm going to say it every video. Like, I miss Disneyland. I can't wait to go back. Yeah. It's going to reopen soon. Sorry, and I'm not ready sorry for on it. that one, right? I miss my friends. Yeah. Oh, I just, I miss my family. I miss, like... It's become normal for me. It's become normalized. It's just, I don't know. I'm just yeah. used to it. And it's like, I've already done how many days? 30 days or something like that. I'm Almost like, 30, yeah. Yeah, so it's like... You know. I think you turn, you have a turning point about the 21st day. It's like they yeah. say it takes how many days to build a habit? It's like just taking a long flight. It's like, it just depends on how you look at it. So it's like, yeah. you know. It's finally got to me. I do notice I'm a lot more tired though. Like way more tired. I, yeah, I it depends sleep. on the day for me, but. Yeah. Woo. Today I slept until 11 or 10.30. I can't believe I did that. Yeah, it just depends on the day. True. Mr. Seagull, say hello to... Miss Binky. Camp Binky. Camp Binky over there. She's got her little hut. Her beach hut. Her beach uh, cabana. She's like Gidget. Uh, it's so funny. It's so little. Like when you walk up the beach and you look to, you look at it and you, look at her. She loves it. Yeah. 
I didn't, I honestly thought she'd be like afraid and not really dig it, but. It's like a dog loop. Yeah, she loves it. And it's like UV protected. It was like 20 bucks on Amazon, by the way. And isn't it funny that it matches our chairs? Like Perfectly. Yeah. Go figure. I love it. She's digging it though. She is happy as a clam. Yep. I really thought she wasn't gonna like it. She likes it. All right, nature, nature's happening. Uh -huh. He's got a, a muscle that he's trying to crack open. I think it might be partially cracked open. Yeah. It looks like it from here. This is our National Geographic. For it's day. our Nat Geo segment, yeah. And now your Nat Geo subject brought to you by Katie and Santa. Oh, he got it up. Oh. Uh oh. Poach. They're so mean, these people. Well, sometimes. they're, yeah. They're like, yo. They just come and take from each other. We've seen, look at them. We tried to, the bigger guys like chase off the little guys. That's what happens, yeah. So mean. Oh, look, he found something. Watch, he's gonna get chased off. Oh, yeah, uh oh. See? Drop it, drop it. Time for a little walk. Before the tide gets higher. Yes. I'm gonna do it. A little stroll. Try to go walk. Get the heart rate going a little bit. I'm gonna start speed walking. Oh my god. All right, the wind has finally pushed us out as well as the tides coming in a little bit. So uh, we are headed up for the day. Time to do more dishes. Oh yeah, dishes. Cycle. Yeah. It more... won't be as pretty as it was yesterday. No. But, you know, we gotta <laughs> clean and get dinner started. All right. Stuff to do. Let's do it. All right, you guys, I'm cleaning in the back room and I found one of my scary masks. So we're gonna scare Katie, it's been a while. All right. Okay, there we go. I can barely see that. <laughs> Horrifying. Okay, let's go get her. Spence, why would you put that on? That's terrifying. <laughs> That's awful. <laughs> I look great right now. I just can't even imagine. I just thought about how. It's alright, I got pizza goggles on. Good. And I hope everybody else does too. I know. Are you ready for the big reveal? It's big too. Like, it's not even the Diamori's box. They had to use the, the generic box because it's. Jumbo. So, yeah. Alright, ready? Go. Oh, is that angels I hear saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it is. Look at that thing. It's a thing of beauty. And we're having salad too. Oh, good. You made the salad. Well, kind of. I Homemade mean, I just. Salad. Well, yeah, it's not from there, though. You yeah, it's it. not from there. So, yay. All right. Yay, us. Hey, everyone. We are looking for redemption here for these beignets. We still have half of a box left. And we had ordered some Mickey shape cutouts, cutters, whatever you call them. So. The question is first, which size do we use? I kind of think maybe like the smaller size might be the best option. Between these two, I'm not sure which one. I think we'll try the two. Um, so we're gonna try it out and see if we can get our Mickey beignet redemption because although they were good, I think they'll be better if they were Mickey shaped. So I'm gonna mix up the mix and we'll see how we do. We definitely know we're not gonna make the oil too hot this time. So last time I think we made way too much of the mix and I think we're just going to cut it in half this time. It says mix two cups of the mix and seven ounces of water. So I'm just going to do one cup of the mix and obviously half the water. Um, we just had too much and we couldn't even eat them all. It was just, it was intense. So I'm going to measure this out, put it in the bowl. All right. 
I just love that this mix is so easy and all you have to do is add water. I think that might be the best part of the whole thing. I don't know. Do you think we should add, do you think we should add more uh, mix? Okay, let's see. Let's see how this comes together. Come on, mix. See, I'm, I, it's hard because it's like you want it kind of wet, but not too wet. Or it's like... Enough to hold a shape. Yeah, basically. And I feel like right now... Well... Because aren't you supposed to roll it out? Yeah, well, not really. Yeah, you're right. So I think we're going to add a touch more. Maybe I poured the water more than I thought. I could have easily done that. That wouldn't surprise me. So... We're gonna try this again. I feel like I had to add a lot more batter than the box called for for some reason this time. But we're gonna see if Mickey shape is the way to go. We also keep in mind, still do not have a way to measure the oil temperature because that's just how we do here. Um, I don't know. I'm feeling good about it that though. Better than the, yeah. It, it does that look good. Work, yeah. And I don't know if the thickness is right either because we're just kind of winging it. But I think we're I think we're gonna get there. We'll try with these three first. Okay. All right, let's try it. Mickey, Minnie, and Mort. And Mort. Oh man. He. Fell. They put, they're puffing up though. Look. No, no. He he fell flat. Oh. Uh, it's not a good one. Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't know if this will puff though. All right, Mort went down the drain. Those other ones look good though. They do, and again, we may not have the right temperature of the oil or the thickness. I wonder if I should. Don't do that. Leave them. I feel good about it. You I really good. feel good. I remember last time though, we didn't leave them in long enough. Remember how they tasted a little doughy on the yeah. inside? Oh, look at poor Mort. Look at him. He's ugly on that side. Okay. I'm gonna flip these guys. Okay, definitely a lot more puff. Oops. Yeah, look at that. I could. Wait! I don't wanna splash grease, but these look good, right? Yeah, they're like little raviolis. Ooh. I mean, I could have done this size. Maybe the next one I'll do a little bit bigger. I just didn't use enough oil, I'm starting to realize, but that was all the oil. Those are beignet left. bites. Yeah, these are beignet bites. This one looks the best right here. This guy. That's Mickey. That's the real Mickey. Does it say, it doesn't say how long. Till golden brown. It's like my face, golden red. I got a little sunburn today. Yeah, you did. But I put sunblock on. I guess it was just out that long that it. I needed to reapply. Oh well guys, if I end up getting wrinkly, sun damage. I'm basically, all right, we're getting there. I almost saw, like, look at, isn't that weird how this kind of looks like a nose? Yeah. Like, right in that spot. Oh, we're going to get the powdered sugar ready, because I'm putting them straight in that powdered sugar. Yeah, they look pretty good to me. They do? It's like I just don't want to undercook them, that's the thing. Flip that, maybe. This guy is a travesty. He's like a chip. Yeah. Let's just try Mickey and Minnie. I guess you don't know to... Oh, I should have put it on a paper towel then, did this? Yeah, soak up the grease. <laughs> That's just how much powdered sugar they're going to have on them. All right, let me, let me use a spoon. Okay. Oh, I forgot about Mort. I forgot all about it. Well done, Mort. Yeah, he's going to be a potato chip. Okay, let's see. These look really good, though, huh? Yeah. Look at it. Wow. Little Minky and Minnie. This guy got a little deformed, but all in all, I'd say not bad. Okay, now it's the taste test. I don't even want to eat these two perfect ones yet. We'll try Mort and see if the batter even is right. Hot club. Hot club. All right, you're trying to try it. I'm gonna give them more powdered sugar. Okay. Mmm. Good, huh? Yeah. Would you say better than our first time? Yeah. I would too. I definitely think better than the first time. It's definitely well done. It's well done, but it it's better than the first time. Mm-hmm. Yes. 
All right, I'm gonna make another one. So you went for the bigger. Yeah, the bigger shape. The bigger cutter. Yep. I don't have much room here. <laughs> Didn't make that much batter, but we're just gonna do two. That's fine. There's only room for that kind of in the pan anyways, right? Yeah, that's true. I didn't put enough oil and I'm, I'm starting to look at. Got the old spatula I gotta break out here. So much concentration. Oh, I should have put more flour down on the... Ah! Oh man, I deformed this one a little bit. This guy... <laughs> it looks silly. Oh well. Maybe they'll go back to shape. Oh! Oh man, that one's not very cute. All right, and I think you flip right away. So that it puffs up? Yeah. I mean, they are puffing, but look at this guy. He's got like jagged edges on him. I'm gonna lay out a paper towel. It's Joe Rody. <laughs> oh, with his... <laughs> with his earrings. Oh my gosh, that was a good one. It does look good. I really should it. Oh. That one looks so bad. The oil's hotter now, that's why. Yeah, it's. De I think the first time we didn't have hot enough oil. I'm now for certain. Because now they're puffed up. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Look at that. Why did I just flip that again? It's like I have obsessive flipping. I mean, I guess it would be way worse if they didn't even puff up at all. You know? I think those are bad. Now, would you say that we got... Oh, those aren't done. Not on that side. Would you say, though, that we have officially got redemption for our first beignets? Oh, yeah. I would say so, too. So we can call this video Beignet Redemption. Mm-hmm. All right. I'm so, so. Okay, I'm going to do this and be smart this time. They don't really look like Mickey's to me. But, you know, at the park, do they really kind of look like Mickey's? Not all the time. Right? Yeah, they do. They okay. just have a, I'm sure they have a way different process of how they do it. Yeah. Okay. It probably gets cut and goes on a conveyor belt or something like that. A conveyor belt. Human conveyor. hands don't ever touch it, probably. You think? Yeah. Okay. I just got them nice and powdered. A little pow pow. Yay! Yeah. I would say that's a win. Winner! Winner, winner! Okay, like usual, after a while you get the hang of it. This one puffed like a major wow. puff. I think because the, the oil is at its best. The oil is hot enough, and what I did was I used the little mini Mickey cutter, you know, the smallest one, and I like peeled it away so it just came apart better. Oh, wow, it's cooking fast. Yeah, it is, it is. But it still needed to cook on the other side, you can tell. It still looks better than what we had, that's for sure. All right, cool off for a second, degrease. Cool down, Selecta. Cool down. I think this might be the winner. This is the Mickey. This is him right there. Oh boy. Look at how puffed he is. I just want to, it's so hot right now, but look at how puffed he is. Yeah. That's a perfectly puffed beignet. Yay. Beignet. <laughs> Beignets. That's, you know, when you did it right is when you can scream Beignet. Okay, I just want to brag. We turned the camera off and I just kept going. And I think I'm getting better and better at these. Look at how fluffy these are. These are like perfect. Look at these hands. These are the hands of somebody who's slaved for hours in the kitchen. I've made a disaster. Look at this mess. Oh my gosh. But the beignets... They look great. I ha I am very proud of myself right now. Very proud. Okay, you guys. Binky. You can barely see her. She's passed out. Spencer actually went to sleep. So, I'm really sorry you're not going to get a bye-bye, everybody, tonight. Uh, we actually filmed it last night, and for some reason it didn't upload. We had some really major uploading issues last night for some reason it was just like being really weird anyway so i apologize that was it for our day that's just what it was um some days are a little more eventful than others i don't think today was especially eventful minus myself getting scared by that terrible mask um and beignet redemption but it was a good day nonetheless 
I uh, hope you're all hanging in there and I hope you all tune into What's Happening Wednesday. Um, hope to see you all there. If you like these videos and you want to see more, let us know by giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to this channel. And don't forget to turn on your bell notifications. That's how you'll know when we're live on Wednesday and every time we upload our video every morning because we always got daily videos for you no matter what. Um, so that being said, we'll see you later and uh, I'm gonna do the best bye-bye everybody I can, but bye-bye everybody.